So here I am in the old rainy New Zealand. So I'm back. I'd done an audition with a human um, and it didn't really work out. The guy was like, yeah, just didn't really suit my style of uh, playing. He was, he was actually pretty good and um, that didn't suit me. Uh, so I've kind of got no option but to come back here to a familiar stomping ground. This is actually where it all started. It's a little uh, town in New Zealand and I'm actually I'm actually knocking on the door of my original bandmate and um, his name is Steve. He's, he's, he's the first uh, band member of Might of the Mopeds with myself um, and this is where the dream started. Well they started here and they also stopped here because Steve went and got himself a job quite some time ago and quit the band and the dream so he burned both those bridges uh, quite severely you know so there's actually good there's more to just starting a band again there's also healing healing needs to take place and that's kind of why I'm here too is to figure out why he'd left the damn band in the first place besides money okay so here we are gonna give this this is the little door the door right here, Steve. Up. See if he even opens. He might not, not even be here. How's it going, man? You're home. You mean who? Are you? Who am I? Um, would you just take a look at this face? No money. Steve, it's me. It's JJ. JJ. JJ, Might of the Mopeds, New Zealand's third most popular comedy folk duo, you, Steve and JJ. So you can't remember the, the competition we went in? And we came third, we beat that Concord's band who stole our name. I don't remember any of that. Yeah. How's the coffee? Oh, it's good. It's got no coffee in it, but... Yes, yeah, sorry, I, I emptied it into my cup. So. That cup actually looks just like my whole cup. Yeah, I wasn't supposed to bring this cup down, so yeah. Actually, a lot of the stuff around here looks like things I used to own. Some of these tools here look like they're mine. I had a hammer just like that. Uh, a lot of hammers look like that, yeah. That's why I bought it. it reminded me of you, so. Got my name on it. Have you still got my car? The white one in my car? Yeah. No, no. I don't know what happened to that. Kind of needed that car. I think someone might have sold that. Am I going to see any of the money for that vehicle? Um, you don't remember that time at Christmas when you came over and stole our family's tree and my father chased you around the streets and all the baubles were dropping all over the street and the presents and the I think a dog bit your foot and you took the dog. Not that particular Christmas, no. Oh. I haven't had very good Christmases, that's that's what it is. Yeah, so I remember there was another Christmas and you really liked my sister and she wouldn't date you and you ran away with her as well. Oof, that happened a few times. Part of the reason I came back after all these years was um, I needed to figure out why you had quit our band. You remember you started that job at the petrol station? You were getting, pumping gas? I went around there before coming here and they said they didn't know anything about you. I didn't work at a petrol station. Well, I've been uh, walking the earth. Yeah. I came from Kung Fu. 
So you're saying that the gas station job that took you away from our dreams, the one that you went to do because you needed money all those years ago, you haven't, you don't, yeah, don't do that job. You. No, I did come. I did come into some money though. Yeah. Uh, how? I um, I found some. Okay. Yeah. Was it in my wallet that went disappearing around the time you were borrowing a lot of my things? Thirty dollar hat too. Yeah, my father used to have a hat just like that. Oh, matches the ribbon and the PJs. It does look good on you. Thanks, man. What was your name again? Do you want to join my band? Yeah. Reunited and it feels so good. Reunited as we are. You enjoying your cup there? Coffee's good.